Jumping out very early. Sea of humanity. Now you can see even Marcus. See a really good spread of players across the entire map, I think, for this, because this is the match. You even see, look, the far west side of the map, you have players doing the drop right over the edge, right over the water, trying to swoop in and get as low as they can. They're trying to play around snobby shores, maybe the, the, the expected empty zones, which I think people might be a little disappointed. Got to get low. Got to get that gun first. You don't want to have a... You don't want it to not go your way in the beginning so, of the game. She had the app on her phone. She wow. just pulled it up. Mac and Tim moving out across these fields, looking for somewhere to settle down. You know, it looks like Cypher is going to get into a fight pretty soon with Here Richard. Here's two some tap. action. They're just right above him. John and yeah. two tap. Two tap being excellent players. This 1v1 situation here, not necessarily the best. Marshmallow's got an angle from the side, some kind of support, gets the drop there. And the force envelop a little one by one, and Ninja now has his eyes on target. He's just going to shoot out that top. He's going to try and do the edit replace maneuver potentially. If you, it's where you, you shoot out a, a surface, immediately place your. There goes own. the remote. The C4. The remote explosive. He's making a push oh. He's Ninja's lobbing your brother. He's lobbing oh, watch out, watch out. Doing a lot of damage there. The player's actually going to be stuck <laughs> behind this wall. That, oh, man. Oh, no. Oh, the disrespect. Bad. 12 shotgun shots later, risky, the Risky, risky. <laughs> you don't want to do that, Lupo. Not bust out the pickaxe and go for, for the memes, disrespect. Go for memes, memes. man. So you I can't believe it. Looks like we have the Tomato Man, to the Tat Man builds up, trying to wall off against his opponents. Watch the fall damage, bud. He's going to build up, try and get that, the height advantage now. It's Tim versus Smith. Max down. One. Oh, oh, good night, Tim. Oh, you didn't know what you were up against, Tim. It's okay. We forgive you. We forgive you. But that is going to do it for Tim, the tap man, and his teammate now. Trying to figure out what to do for He's the thumbnail. He's just trying to stun out here, you know? Video. Yeah. <laughs> How many yellow arrows can you fit in one thumb? I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> and then I will also see that on Twitter. Looking yes. forward to that later as well. All right. So as the storm begins to converge here, we're down to 29 players left in this game three million dollars on the line for charity and Allier is positioned himself nicely he does have some eyes up there with that green ar i mean you, you can potentially take some shots but I, I really wouldn't i wouldn't do that in this instance. okay or you just dance i think he heard his name and just was like you know what? i'm just gonna dance i don't blame him now he's kind of he's in an interesting position because if there's players at the top of any of these structures and he hugs too far away any of the walls if he's too close to any of the edges they might have an angle with a snipe shot and that might be the end of it you know courage kenneth hanging out the top of their metal tower if you noticed uh ninja and marshmallow were in a, a wood tower the option the choice to, to for different materials why do you think that is because I, th I feel like a metal tower if they've been sitting in there uh roasting <coughs> marshmallows sorry bud uh that long i mean what's uh why the, the strategy there i mean i think is very clear right you know they were able to fully generate the metal on that one so this is going to take a lot of shots to be able to take that down courage though gets the explode onto jordan and now those da the damage though did come for kenneth and kenneth has to pop those minis and get back into a position where he had 100 shields there, but did not expect that shot. So that's why they ended up putting, you know, the, that, as I like to call, the backboard right there to just give them a little bit of cover as they look to engage on any players. Ninja and Courage just right next to one another. And I'm worried for Ninja because the wood, it's very flimsy. It's not like metal cast. It, it is a little bit more flimsy. And uh, Courage is a force to be reckoned with with that grenade launcher. Really is. You don't necessarily need to talk about Ninja's wood materials on the broadcast like that. So, uh, I, I understand, though. Yeah, you probably should have gone with the shot. Ooh. Long range shot there. Loser Fruit going for the montage. Going for it. The fight was decided before she could interject, though. And Ninja eliminate. Actually, that was a. Uh... Wait a minute. Was that was that Myth and in, in, in the crew? I have to actually. I, I'm actually stunned if that is actually the case here, because I'm not seeing Myth on the map anymore, my friend. Big oh, fight just man. gone south of TSM boys. That's rough. That is rough. Myth and Paul George are out. Valky Ray currently shooting at Loser Fruit. Murder Beats, he's, he's upset. They're shooting like mad over there. Just going, just taking shots. Seeing if they could bait anyone out, right? Put it, because sometimes too, right? You know, if they do have the coordination, they could, you know, like, for example, Marshmallow can like peek over, put some shots out, and then the player can poke out whoever's going to try and challenge it. And Ninja can actually go for that snipe. And now there's going to be a fight going on to Valkyrie. It's all oh, going to be down and out. That is going to do it. Loser Fruit and Backpack Kids still very much in this game.
This is, I mean, there's a benefit to hiding in the bottom of a building that's like, <laughs> that's like three stories deep, okay? You, no one's really going to look at you. Chandler Kitty plays. They've been hanging out on the west side of the circle pretty consistently, not trying to avoid engagements. This is definitely two players that are going for the win. They're not trying to get overly aggressive. A little trading and healing there. Courage can at the top of the hill. They're going to try and defend against any push from outside the zone. They, they, uh, like I referred to this earlier as gatekeeping. Look at the, the look of, of determination on this Optic player's face as he's got eyes. He's got a bead on his on the, on the next target and they kind of have zone advantage. Gloom, he's, he, let's say he, he drops this. Oh, looks 50 damage. That that's light like damage as well. This is bad. This is very bad. Oh, Kyla, that what a play. That is just a crazy first. <laughs> the third. I've spotted bad guys. Uncle Jack, wow, doing it. I've seen more BM from players in this charity event than I think I've <laughs> ever seen any. This is ridiculous. A lot of friendships ending. It feels it's like a, Mario Party out here. It's supposed to be a celebration of Fortnite instead of just Salt City. Why can't we be friends? You have a just very saying. angelic voice. Stop it. Kitty plays Chainlink. Oh, They're kind of in the bottom of the uh, of uh, of the mix here. They've got a lot. They have a lot of people bumping. Ninja trying to take a shot. He's got that gold scoped. And they've like, committed. The they've committed to this action. location, Lupo. I mean, have they even uh, they've even moved there from there yet? I've, I've, they've oh. been there long enough that I th I think they own the house that they built. I'm a little worried because Allier has a very good shot on them. I just hope they don't gargoyle and get a little bit too distracted. Oh boy! Marshmallow going for the snipes as well. Look at these boys. This is it, it, you can very much tell that Marshmallow and Ninja have played together quite a bit because they have a, a very similar play style, which is almost terrifying. Because oh, they're going aggressive. See? They're just going to start pushing. They're trying to mix it up, go for big plays. Just got to be careful. Marshmallow at this point in time just uh -oh. trying to support. The nades are coming in, though. Oh, boy, Prince Royce. Oh, this is going to be Royce. rough just running away from this one wisely Bandages enough. Bandages in hand. I don't blame him, man. If you had grenades coming in potentially from Ninja and Marshmallow, wouldn't you run? I feel like I'd, <laughs> I'd, I'm, I'm already running. And also just look at Courage and, and you know, I mean, really, Courage and Kenneth just continuing to have that upper hand. I mean, the, the circle gods have been in their favor, but Ali A just eliminated loser fruit there. Number of players remaining. Declining. The shots coming out. Courage. Look at that. Look at that fire they're, there. Their the coordination. Is literally, they're firing at two different opponents at the same time. It, unafraid. I think but you might want to look out because Ninja's dropping some grenades in there, boys. Everyone just realized that you got to look at the giant metal tower that's in oh, yeah, the nice <laughs> dude up there. Maybe we should do something Maybe about it. Maybe we should handle the business, but as a matter of fact, uh -oh. the nade launch comes through. Uh -oh. Courage throws down. He only has one. He <gasps> takes out Marshmallow. Oh, down. Courage takes on Marshmallow. Ten players left. Okay. Can you, can I, I'm going to build back up to you get bandages, okay? They have no choice. They got to go in. With Courage, you can't yeah, they, they have to push move. because they have, they 30, have 35 seconds remaining, so they just want to be able to establish any kind of control and as well as get resources. That fire will help, for sure. They are very go. low on resources right now, Topping guys. off the HP, like you were oh, saying. Of course. The, the campfire is going to be crucial here, but I feel like if you're in a position where you can just kind of poke in on some of these fights, Maybe topping off that last like 20 HP isn't the best best bet. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Kitty plays uh, Chandler going to start it? making some moves here. Yeah, was it worth it? We'll see. That is the question. Kenneth though goes back for the poke. Kitty backing away. Doesn't have any heals and then you also or any shields and then you also have shots coming down, forcing Kitty to have to disengage. Storm now is going to start to come in here and things are getting very tight as the players. Are just starting to converge on one another and just look at what Ninja, we have. You have Ninja and Marshmallow in a cubby hole. Just, just letting it happen. Courage. Courage, Courage with another lasering one. Lasering Chandler down. I believe that's five eliminations right now for Uncle Jack. <gasps> Alie going down. You've got that's six. Oh, Alie believes it all right. Death from above. And they, they just, I mean, this has been their game plan this entire time. Just look at this courage. Love it. He, has, he has incredible accuracy. Just lasering in there, Kenneth. Getting the, uh, I believe, a knockdown in there or a limit. Uh, he, he may have finished a kill. So Kitty now, it, you know, being down low like this, and you know, one has to wonder, you have to be very worried for Kitty, but still, though, the players that everyone's looking at, 
two teammates formerly you know in, in the last competition that they played in now going up against one another here ninja marshmallow <laughs> now, you could see that ninja had the had the, the little uh, the, the blueprints out I, he was using the edit to look through and courage and kenneth are above ninja's gonna try and watch him from underneath i think they might start putting down the uh, the pyramids just try and play defensive build up a layer here something they can sit on top of and they still i think courage they still don't realize ninja and marshmallow is just hanging out in there yeah they're just chilling this is, and I think they're going to uh, make a push on Kitty potentially. Yeah, I think they just want to sweep game. this one through. And Kitty, I mean, she just knows that this is a, a, a rough spot. And here it goes. The storm's Shuffle pushing in. That's a jump pad from Ninja. They're trying to make a play from above. Marshmallow's, Marshmallow's hanging on the back. He's, he's hanging back. He's just going to provide support, but Courage is going to go up onto Ninja. Courage is taking damage. Ninja, though, might be able to make this one happen and go over to Kitty. Unbelievable gameplay. Uh, there we go. We're back at uh, Courage Kenneth trying to hack their way out. He doesn't have any shields. The top down Ninja got the advantage. He pushed up. Kenneth is down. Marshmallow gets the knockdown of Kenneth. We got a 1v2. <gasps> That's it. Woo! Ninja and Marshmallow. You have uh, Kitty plays as well. Courage is still up. Courage is still alive. The crowd's going for Ninja. Courage is trying to make a play happen. He doesn't really have much to work with here. One million dollars for your charity on the line. And right now, Ninja and Marshmallow, they have the power position. They have the high ground. They have the control. You think this comes down to a campfire off and see who can survive? The Courage has half <gasps> oh. a hit point. I don't know. If, if I don't a know butterfly if, hits him, he goes, he gets eliminated. I don't know if Courage has anything to work with. And then Kitty, I mean, she, she's like, going to have to make a move eventually. This, this game is essentially Ninja and Marshmallow's to win. This is their game to win. Ninja Mar completely turned it around here. They were stuck in that cubby hole and yeah, they pushed they their way out just the right time. On they, they let Courage and Kenneth do the work for them. How and much they, of the work do you think that they did? All the work, baby. All the work. All the work. All the work. All right, gentlemen. You're set up. You're ready to go. Looks like Kitty's trying to take advantage of potentially. I think that's Courage. Oh. Yeah, yeah, Courage yeah. gets it. Good night. Kitty out guard. Oh, the oh, look of frustration. Yeah, look of frustration, but now or Courage. Courage with 7 HP and a dream. He doesn't have anything to work with. He knows that he's basically in a terrible spot, and that is basically. Ooh, that is a small circle. It's not over yet, though, folks. Make some noise for Courage. See if you can bring it back. Let's go. Yeah, I mean, at this point now, if you're part of the Courageous, you, you got to believe. You have to believe. But he is Bombas. in such He's a bad oh. spot. <laughs> a look of pure fear. He's taking shots. Ninja. All he has to do is breathe on him, and he's going to get the win. Yeah. Ninja gets Let's the go. win. <laughs> Here at the Fortnite Pro-Am, him and Marshmallow come out on top. Wow. What a game. But what a, what a performance from Courage as well. <laughs> Oh, that last, the last couple circles were so tense. I, I'm impressed by the fact that Ninja was able to capitalize on remaining hidden. They sat in a this box and, and oh, just bandaged up, licked their wounds, and, and waited for just the right time to come out. They I, played it so, so intelligently there, Cassie. I, I need to. I mean, you played with Ninja a lot. How do, how do you turn that around? You're, you're hiding. I'm pretty sure he hacks. Uh, 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 <laughs> it was just tactical uh, waiting, okay? Tactical, that's tactical waiting. waiting. Tactical Listen, waiting. Well, that's what Marshmallow did, strategy. too. <laughs> <laughs> Marshmallow did that as well. He just he sat there, he waited, and then he shot a guy in the back of the head. And he just supported his teammate, and then Ninja went in for it. But Courage also, he was in a really bad spot, but still, though, what a performance. A fill-in here for, for the Pro-Am at the last minute. Uncle Jack doing the work, but it's this man right here, Ninja, and his partner, Marshmallow, who get the victory. Let's actually send it over to Justine. I am here with our duos winner, Ninja and Marshmallow. Guys, congratulations. Thank you so much. This is amazing. Just super pumped. Oh, my God. I mean, this came down to like the last second. And, yeah. and, and you know what's incredible is watching you guys play here in real life. I mean, you guys are watching it online, but there's so much energy here in the stadium. Yeah, I can, you can just feel it. Like after every single fight, you hear one massive shotgun blast and the entire crowd is just freaking out, losing their minds because like just, it's just so intense. It's way more obviously epic uh, IRL than it is, you know, online. It's amazing. It really, it's crazy. And you guys, I feel like you worked really well together. Oh yeah, so. Uh, oh yeah, well, I, you know, I just thought maybe, you know, I had to try. Yeah. 
Uh, he said that uh, you know he, 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 we've been putting in a lot of work and a lot of practice, and uh, you know, and Marsh is just happy that you know he, I think he promised a couple of people that he was going to win, and uh, he, we brought it home. So. And you definitely did. And I think the biggest question that we had here, I, I hate to bring it up, but are, how are you able to see under there? Do you want to relay? Maybe? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. I, mean, I already know how he's able to. So uh, he actually has like super vision, like really good vision. So And uh, we uh, just bumped up the brightness on his monitor and he was able to just like, I mean, he actually did a really good job. He was shooting out everyone when they were building up and, and that was our strategy going into it. So it was really impressive. Congratulations, guys. We're going to throw it back up to the casters. And it was on this day that a human and a snack food were able to get the victory. Congratulations to Ninja and Marshmallow. And again, I, I got to give Marshmallow just all the credit in the world. Jokes aside, homie's playing in a mask. I'm never going to say we knew we were going to win, but like we knew we had a good shot. Uh, all of Marshmallow's management was like, he's playing more Fortnite than he is making music. Like, you guys should probably do well. And, uh, and we, we had a couple games of practice, like a couple hours of practice before, and we knew what we wanted to do, and we just stuck to it, and it worked out. Well, I think that's a good problem to have, and clearly it has worked out. But now we need to give you guys yes. the prizes here. We've got the golden pickaxes, golden boy, Dr. Lupo. And here you have it, guys, the 2018 Pro-Am Fortnite Tournament winners. Congratulations, guys. Thank you so much. We're going to be heading up to the Founders Club now to see what else we have. There's more gameplay to be had. See you guys soon.